Mama! Uzo! You are back. Yes, one. Hey. Uh, Mama, I, I did not see fresh tomatoes. But I'll go back and check if I need Don't worry. Uh, maybe I should even leave the cooking till Thursday. Mama, no! I'm sure I'll find this evening at the evening market. I know. Ah, you've worked all day. You need some rest. Mama, I'm not complaining. I know. Oh, <laughs> Oh, welcome, Papa. Ah, my daughter. Sir. I thought you have gone. No, Papa. I went to the market to get some food stuff for Mama. Oh, that's good of you. Thank you, sir. Ah, Udoka has really helped me today. <laughs> Especially with some clothes I had concluded only the dry cleaners will wash. <laughs> that's good. That's good. Mama. <laughs> Mama. <laughs> let, let me can start boiling the ingredients and get everything ready. Okay, my dear. I'll join you soon. Okay. Oh, what a beautiful wife Michael has chosen for himself. Mm, and a good cook too. <laughs> Did you taste the goosey soup she made last week? Was she the one that made that goosey soup? Of course! <laughs> hey! It was so nice that I began to wonder when your cooking suddenly improved. Stanley, <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Ah, of course you know no one cooks better than my wife. I was only trying to compliment Udoka's effort. I just hope so. <laughs> God! <laughs> Honestly, I can't wait to see Michael take Udoka as wife. He loves her so much. He is looking forward to that day with great expectation. <laughs> that day. That very day. Ah, <laughs> anyway, well let's just leave it. Okay. <laughs> Let me join her in the kitchen. It's okay. <laughs> If you people have abducted my daughter. <laughs> Your daughter. Yes. Oh, you mean my son's wife. Don't mind her. By the time Mike comes back to take Doka back to London with him, you will only get to see her once. Only once in every five years. Hey! <laughs> ah, heaven forbid. That will not happen. Not my daughter. She will be coming back to see me because because <laughs> no problem. Uh Udoka, please take them to the house. No, 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 no. That won't be necessary. It's even good we saw you here. Uh, we are in a hurry to see Ndoka and his family. Oh, is it about the death of his wife? Yes, we've not been there. I think you people have to go at once. I was here yesterday. Mm -hmm. hmm? We have to get going. Okay. You don't mind, dear? It's okay. I'll come and pick you tomorrow, okay? Right, well. Take care oh, of yourself. No problem. Bye, okay. sir. Okay, dear. Bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Once you're there, you forget everything about me. Oh, Forgetting now. that there's nobody that helped me. Hey, I'm back now. Things very soon. I'll get married. You. Get married. <laughs> and you will not see me again. Yes. 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 Sit down there. Hey, hey. Uh, uh -huh. um, I really thank you for welcoming us into your home. Your husband, before he died, respected me. Not because I am his cousin, but because we loved each other. I too respected him before his death. I know it. Thank you. And I appreciate it. Uh, you are my wife, my sister, 
and my daughter. Your home is equally mine. We share the same happiness. That is why I have brought this handsome young man, Amos, and his people. He has come to ask the hand of Udoka in marriage. My husband, mm -hmm. I appreciate your concern over my daughter's future. Thank you. And I'm happy to learn that you really want her to get married. And to the right person. Amos here is the right man. He's a very nice man. He must be. If not, you wouldn't have brought him. Uh, thank you. Um, but my daughter has been betrothed to another man. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. That's not a good answer, Ugona. That's not a good answer. Where is Doka? Call her out first. Let her speak for herself. Ah. Now you know her answer will be no. And you know it. Ugona, in case you don't know, children of nowadays prefer to choose their, their husbands and wives themselves. Mm -hmm. Not ones chosen for them by their parents. Call her. Let her speak for herself. Okay. Mm. No, don't worry. I, the whole thing is under my control. I am in control of the whole situation. Let us Your uncle is here again with the man. He said I should call him. Mama, why is uncle doing this now? Why does he keep doing this? He knows Michael is coming home soon for my traditional marriage. Why does he keep doing this now? You do have told Ezindu this more than ten times. He keeps on bringing people to ask for your hand in marriage. I don't know how else to talk to him. Eh? I just don't know. Tell him to go home. T -t Tell him I'm not, I'm not well or something. Sure, tell him I'm not at home, Mama. Tell him I'm not around. Don't you know how your uncle behaves? That he hardly takes no for an answer. Please come and tell him yourself. Oh? Be good name. Oh? Hmm. Mama, uncle is getting on my nerves. Please. Uncle is annoying me, Mama. Please. Uncle is annoying me. He's annoying me, Mama. He's annoying me. Oh? Be good name. Be good. Hmm. Ah, ha, my Oma, Adama, Udoka, your face always reminds me of your brave father. Uh, this is Amos. You remember him? I came with him once to greet you when you were returning from the market. Uh, um, I remember him. Yes. Mama, I have to go and play to Victoria. Says she's waiting for me. Udoka. Udoka. But we can't. Udoka. Udoka. Udoka! Come back, Udoka! That is not how to go about it! You see? I told you what arrest must be. It's all your fault! Ugonna, I hope you are not bringing up this girl to disrespect me, her uncle! Ha! Let's go! Let's go! Udoka! Come back, Udoka! You will see. Hey! Ugonna! Mama! Mama! You remember when we were in secondary school? Those good old days when you were still dating us, Zeman. <laughs> you always told me that your son will marry my daughter. Of course. Because I used to call us Zeman an ugly man. <laughs> Gona, I don't like it too. <laughs> ah. Gona, I can't think of my son having his children through any other girl than your daughter. I know. Christy, you brought happiness in my life. And that of my daughter. 
My husband's death brought that cloud in my life. I love him. I love him so much. Udoka was his only pride. But they took him so soon. You and your husband were there for me. Especially when they blamed me innocently for his death. I wanted to take all that he left behind for me and my only child, Udoka. I don't know. I don't know how to thank you. You're my best friend. Remember the afternoon we were coming back from school and they were hanging electric cable for the first time to give us light. Do you still remember that? The place was restricted. But out of my folly, I walked right in. And the cable almost got me. But you ran and pushed me. And the cable fell on your leg. Almost paralyzing that leg for life. Oh. It could have been me. It could have been me, of course. It's good to me. It was two weeks to your traditional wedding. Remember? I'm glad I could save your life. If you didn't take that risk, I might have been dead. Chrissy, let's forget about the pains of the past. Alright? You are such a friend indeed, Una. Your husband from me. Take up my wife. <laughs> bye bye. Bye. Be a good girl, though. Yes, ma'am. Um, Mama, you and Michael's mother, you seem so close. <laughs> you never really told me the depth of your friendship. The need never came. They almost sent you to school in London the day Michael left for the first time. Are you serious? Oh. So what happened? Your father, out of pride, he refused. He said as his, uh, his only child, that it was his duty to train you, to raise you up with his sweat the way he wants. And so, it was nothing. So, that woman, that woman is still coming here to deceive you, Doka, from settling down with any of the young men I have carefully selected for you, eh? No, I isn't. Is there anything wrong with my daughter marrying my best friend's son? When eh? last did you set your eyes on that boy? And you, Doka, if you see Michael, that boy Michael today, can you even recognize him? Eh, hey, Uncle, he's been sending his pictures and he writes often. Eh! Hey, was that how, Ugona, you married my brother, her father? What exactly is your point? That you two old women should stop wasting Udoka's beauty and future. Let her marry now that men are flocking around her. Uncle, Michael is coming home very soon. Shut your mouth. I said shut your mouth. That is what you, your mother, and Michael's mother have been saying for the past nine years, if not ten. Michael has been studying. He has been studying. Yes. Exactly. Uncle, exactly. To, to, to study pharmacy is not easy. To make a choice of a husband and settle down is not easy either. 
That is why the kindred gave me the task to ensure that you, Udoka, get married and on time too, before you become a liability to the family. No, I appreciate your concern over my daughter's future. But there is no but in it, Ugona. There is no but. Udoka, take the one God has given to you now and forget dreaming about a husband that you will never see again. No. For some time. Hey! My mother gave me this bottle of red oil to give to you. Ah, oh, go Eh? Hey. Oh, can you imagine? Ugona will never stop watering herself. Eh? Hey! By the way, Udoka, how did you know that song I was singing? My mother taught me the song. She sings it to me all the time. Ah, nice. It's more or less from generation to generation. Mm -hmm. Hey, your mother and I used to sing that song when we were in secondary school. Mm. It was good old days. Mm. Um, Mama, does Michael know the song? Mm. I wouldn't know, but he has heard me sing it so many times. You know what? Your mother and I are planning to sing it for you and Michael on your traditional wedding day. Mm. Yes. Mm. <laughs> that would be nice, so. That would be nice for Michael and I to sing it. <laughs> yes. Ah. Duka, I can't wait for that day. Me too. Hey. Me too, Mama. <laughs> Christiana! Duka, that must be, that must be Michael's father. Please go and check. I'll, I'll join you. Christiana! Yes, Chief! Christy, come and share this good news with... Papa? Oh, my daughter, you are even here. Yes, sir. That's better. Oh. You are very excited. What is it? Yes. I just received a letter from Michael. He'll be coming home end of this month. Are you serious? <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Eh? You don't know what is happening. You're hey. asking me if I'm serious. Hmm. He wrote the flight number, the arrival date, and time. Just, just take a look. Hey! Hey! expected time of... Uh... Oh. <laughs> ah! God! So finally, my Michael is coming home at the end of this month. At least, let me have the opportunity of getting him around this place. Ah, instead of traveling to London to see my son every time. Ah, Udoka, just wait for me. Eh? I will personally break this news to your mother. My Michael is coming home. Udo, the long expected time is here with us. So you need to get prepared. Fashion yourself towards that particular date, okay? <laughs> and that will be great. Very great. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hey! Who goes? Who goes? Oh, my dear. Mama, Mike is coming back. Hey, very soon. This whole community will gather for you and your daughter. 
It will be a thing of joy for me to watch my own daughter go to a family I've taken as my own. Hell, I didn't know it would happen mm. so soon. I wasn't expecting him to nest you. My dear, whenever he comes back, be it five years from now, God's time is always the best. What will I do that day to welcome my son? Hmm. What will I do? Eh? Will it be a party or an offala? Which one do you think would be most appropriate? Tell me. You just have to welcome your son with happiness and joy. Hey. I think that is it's more than enough. It's more than enough. Ugo, let's hmm. go and plan on what we we'll wear that day. Let's go and plan the lesson we wear that day. Do what? So that she will eat before she goes. We will spend this time with her. Hey! Turn it upside down, right? My dear, i Are you sure you recognize him when he returns? Why not? Ha. Huh. Or do you think he would have changed that much? Don't mind me, though. You'll be as white as an Oh. My good years. My sister. You're very lucky you did not marry one of those Oibo women. Eh? Eh? <laughs> not my Michael. Mm hmm? See, eh? Uh, you, you need to see the way he talks about me each time he writes to his parents. Um, mm hmm? Wow. But I hope he will still remember the way he used to sneak behind your father's house to steal his mango before he travels. <laughs> stop it, okay? <laughs> yeah, just stop it, just stop it. Okay. See, 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 let me just tell you people. Mm -hmm. eh? yeah. My Michael is a big boy now. Mm -hmm. My Michael is a big man now. Oh. He doesn't steal mangoes anymore. We hear you, we hear you. Hey, do. So very soon we'll not be seeing you again. You and Michael will go and live overseas. Don't worry, I'll be coming to visit you people in the village from time to time. Uh, mm -hmm. eh. Is it true you'll be visiting school there or what? Actually, I'll be going to school and working at the same time. Mm -hmm. Then, why are you making your hair now? Eh? End of the month is still very far off. Uh, Mary, you don't understand. See, I want to start plating my hair now so they can be very full by the time Michael comes back. Oh, Victoria, let's make her hair. Please make my hair. Who make my hair. Long, I want it very long. <laughs> very long. After all, he's used to seeing your Yibo hair. Yes. Abby. <laughs> Abby. Abby. Uh, let's. People should make sure my hair is nice. If it's we nice. are giving you the don't latest worry. style now. <laughs> Handle with care. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I want her. I want her so much that I can't even think of any other girl. Udoka is such a pretty girl. Just like her father, a very handsome man. When that man was alive. But oh, death. Death has no respect. Nai, oh. is there nothing you can do for me? I have been trying. Eh? But I'll continue to try. Uh, but what is shaking Udoka and her mother's head is... Obodoibo, overseas. Her mother believes that Michael will marry Udoka and take all of them there. That's my problem. If that is the case, mm. I have lived in Europe and I still travel there quite often. Yeah. Yes. Huh. In that case, you have to bring more money so that I can entice her and her mother. That's what is needed. I am prepared to do anything. I could almost visualize our wedding and our happy home together. That's what we want. Eh? But to achieve that, you have to play your part very well. Hey, I know what to do. I know, I know exactly what to do. Just have this, you know. You know what to do now. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, good afternoon. I brought the Agusi soup. Very good. Uh, I, I wasn't even expecting you now. I, 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 well, I thought you would come later. I, I have some things to do in, uh, later, so that's why I brought the soup now. Okay. Udoka is such a nice girl. She has been cooking for me ever since my wife died. Is it's that correct? Yes. Uh, Udoka, greet Amos. <laughs> good afternoon. Hmm, good afternoon. Uncle, let me drop this thing in the kitchen. Uh. Mm. Udoka. Udoka. Uh. Mm. 
Don't you recognize Amos? Eh? The man who is seeking for your hand in marriage. <laughs> Let me drop this thing for you. Uh, it's okay. Udoka! 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 Stop behaving like a child. Go after her. Follow her. Go and try. You think you you think your money can do everything? Try your own. I've been trying for you for you. Listen to me. Stop following me around. I will follow you around the rest of my life. I don't care what I encounter just to have your consent. But there are other girls around for Christ's sake. God, I have only one life to live and I intend spending it with no other person but you. I cannot marry you. Can't you understand that? Look, my fiancé will soon be back and my traditional marriage date has been fixed. Udo, Udoka, Udo, let me alone. Things can still change. Give me a chance. Look, I beg you in God's name. Stop following me around. Stop following me around, oh. Before my in-laws will see us and get the wrong impression. Leave me alone. Udo, Udo, Udo. Leave me alone. Uh -uh. Come near me again. My son, eh? So how was your final exam? Eh? It was okay, mom. Was, so, was... my... <laughs> so my son is now a pharmacist. Oh God, thank you. Hey, eh? hey, eh? did you miss my food? Oh yeah, I really did, mom. I did. I know you missed. Christy, my... <laughs> leave him alone. Now, when we get home, you will have time to ask your questions. I huh? can't wait. Ah, let yeah. him relax, please. Yeah, educate. Yeah. Man, just look at you. You've really changed, you know. Well, we're all right too. Yeah, so, <laughs> just, so how are you enjoying the country? Enjoy is okay, as you can see. We're just keeping it real. It's not as bad as people think it is. Oh, of course, of course, I know that. Yes, so my son, ah, you know what? I have made your favorite egusi soup. We stop fishing, uh, Sarah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Mom, I can't wait to get home. Christy, why don't they allow him get home? I then you serve him the food. food uh, definitely, he was going to enjoy hey. it. Hey, look at how big you are. <laughs> oh, you've grown so Don't big. Fatty eh? bomb <laughs> <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> ah, I'm so happy you're back. I'll be your It's too much burger, man. I know. <laughs> 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 oh,
you think what I'm wearing is okay? Where are you going to? Uh, we're going to work on Michael now. No, my dear. You're not going anywhere. Mama, why? Don't you think you'll be angry with me that I didn't go there to see him? You have to sit here and wait for him. You are his bride. He has to come for you first. Then you can go and celebrate with him later. Alright? My baby has grown so big. I'm so happy. If only you witnessed that. Yes, it's wonderful. Oh my God. Huh? Oh my God. Hey. Dad? Yes, Mom. Um, I really don't know how to say this, but I want to thank both of you for making me the man that I am today. See, sometimes I sit and I ask myself, where and what would I have been able to do without you? And based on that, I'm dedicating this to both of you to show how glad I am over your huge investment on me during my years of studies as a pharmacist. Hey! Chief, oh my god. Oh my baby, I'm so proud of you. I'm really proud of you. Thank you very much. You Dad. didn't disappoint me. Thanks, Dad. Congratulations. Thank you very much, Dad. Wow. The most important thing that I'm proud of is that you never forgot home or me, your mother. Mom, how could I ever forget home? You're the reason why I'm alive today. <laughs> you see, this means so much to me. A lot of people traveled abroad for studies. Only few, just few, came back with something. Today, I am glad to say that you are among the few that brought pride and honor to their respective families. Congratulations, my son. Thank you, Dad. My blessings I give to you. Oh, thank you. Congratulations. Dad. Thanks, Dad. Thanks again. Go, 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 go. I'm so happy. Hey. Thank you so much, <laughs> I'm almost done, Mom. Are you coming with us? Oh, no, I have to stay back to prepare dinner. Oh. Mom, I just wish you could prepare that my favorite soup. Of course, I'll do that. Um, that reminds me. Have you seen Udoka? Udoka. Udoka. Okay. Oh, you mean uh, Mr. Moses' daughter? Of course, yes. Ah, how could you have forgotten such a nice wife you chose yourself? Oh, well, Mom, I have not really forgotten her. But, you know, I remember those days, you know, when we were much younger. I used to call her my wife then, you know, back in the days when I used to sneak to the back of the house to pluck oranges and mangoes. So tell me, Mom, how is she now? Ah, you need to see her yourself. You remember you almost told me she would make a good wife when I visited you in London. I I guess I was homesick then. And she was about the only girl I remember, you know, back home. Anyway, now that you're going out with your father, please do stop by to see her and her mother, okay? Oh, Mom, let's see how the day turns out. I'll try my best to see them. Okay. I must run along now. I'm sure Dad is waiting for me outside. Yeah, I have to get back to the kitchen soon. And Mom, remember, my favorite dish. Don't forget, and don't forget to see you.
I'm coming. I can't see my car. Wait. I came to see my car. Where is it? Don't you know his house? We do now. But at least by now, where you are should be his house. Look, look, um, you people should come and start going, please. Because Michael will soon be here and I don't want gossip. Exactly. That's why we came. Gossip. Huh. We need to see how the whole place is bubbling and shaking with news of his return. And even his forthcoming traditional marriage with you. Udo, I hope he came back with a dress we we'll wear for you that day. We, your friends, will not accept anything less than imported materials. Mm. Uh, okay. You people should come and go, eh? When Michael comes, I'm sure he'll tell me all about it. Wait, wait. I trying to see. You've not seen him since he came back. Eh, I mean, my mother said as a bride, it's better for him to come and see me first. Okay. <laughs> That's true. At least, this is marriage, not friendship. Anyway, Mary, let's get going. I'm sure by now, Michael will be on his way to this place. Do, do, please don't forget to get our own goodies from where you turned with. Please. Okay. I'll see you later. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Be <laughs> <laughs> tighted. London, London marriage. <laughs> see, my sister, if London marriage is like this, let me marry the village champion that I know now. <laughs> Please let them go with their London man. <laughs> Forget uh, politicians and their politics. Eh? <laughs> Biko, if you are really interested in that land, mm -hmm. I am willing to part uh, you know, with it for seven million. <laughs> Nadozia, stop mentioning big numbers. I'm going to give you four million naira. Eh? Four million. <laughs> chikwa, chikwa. Chikwa, no. mm. You see the other plot of land there? Yes, the I know. The one beside I, I it. I know, I know. I sold it for nine million. Uh, but uh, because of our long-standing relationship, yes. and uh, for the fact that your son wants to build uh, a pharmaceutical factory there, uh -huh, me, I will benefit, and my community too will benefit. Of course, you uh, know that. that. Okay, for that reason. I will give it to you at uh, 6.5 million. Uncle, um... Why, 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 why don't you try and reach a compromise with my father? Eh, uh, Michael, tell your father to stop uh, stinginess. Oh, yeah, Omega. Look, pay money. If you like, keep talking from now till Jesus comes again. I am going to give you four million naira. Four That's million what naira. I have for that land. Yes. Four million naira. Mm. Oh, the man. Come and take the land. Force me. Uncle, Force me. Uncle, wait. Uncle, um. I, I really like the site where that land is. Dad, let's offer him five million. He doesn't deserve it. <laughs> Nadozie, you don't deserve it. You owe me a favor. You know that. Uh, I'm so bad now. 
and my son. Six million or no deal. If your father lies, let him come and collect. Me. I know where to catch you. <laughs> I, I know that. Forget that. Let him come and collect. Me. I know where to catch you. Uh, uh, that man. No problem. You people can go. I will get it though. I know where to catch you. It, it not be this man. <laughs> I know where to catch him. Um, Dad. Um, on a second thought, I, I think we should go back to that land. I want to take a second look at it. Oh my God. Look at, what is the time now? Are we not going to see Udok again? That this, this land is very important to me. I mean, we can always do that some other time. Michael, that land is not running away from there. There is every need for you to see our relations. Those you have not seen for the past few years. Uh -huh. Dad, I, I'm not going back to London in many years to come. Oh I'm home to stay. It will be a mark of respect and regard if we go and see Udoka and the mother. Dad, okay, fine, but... We can always see them some other time, but right now, I really want us to go back and, and survey that land. It's okay. If that is what you want, let's go. Thank you, Doc. Again. Listen, I know how you feel, but you're wrong. Michael just got home. Perhaps he's tired from the long journey home. It's been four days, Mama. Mama, four days. Four days. I know. I know. Look, I think, Mama. Do you think he will ever come to see me? Of course. Of course. They have their own arrangements. Have you seen his mother lately? No. But they must be busy. See, Michael has not come home for a long time. A lot must be happening there. Yes, a lot is happening there. A lot is happening there without me. My girl loves you. You do not bother. You have waited for years. What difference will a few mothers make? Come, Udo. I've just told you this time after time that my girl is there for you. He will come. When will he come and see me? When will he come and see me? He will come. Oh? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Dad? Mm -hmm. It's like we came in at the right time. Exactly the dish you requested for is waiting for you, my dear sir. Okay, Mom. Um, you know what? I'll quickly rush in and take a shower and I'll join you at the dining. All right. All right. You stayed long. Udoka must have spent the whole time discussing about the past and the forthcoming traditional marriage. On the contrary, it was uh, Nadozia and his long talk. Uh, we went to see his land. I mean, you didn't go to see Udoka? I don't know what is wrong with your son. Each time I mention Udoka, he either changed the subject or postpone the previous arrangement made to see her. What does that mean? He ought to have gone to see her and the mother by now. <laughs> he hasn't seen her since he came back. You better go and talk to your son. 
let him know that this, he is no longer in, in, in London. He needs to see his in-laws, at least uh, accord them that respect. Showed me that you and your father will go and see Udoka and her mother today. Oh, Mom, we had a lot of places to go and a lot of things to do. A lot of things to do? That you didn't have time for your wife to be? Wife? What are you talking about, Mom? Is that supposed to be an excuse or a joke? For Christ's sake, Mom, what, what was this stuff about Udoka and I getting married anyway? Michael, what kind of rubbish is that? Mom, I'm, I'm no longer a child. I used to like Udoka, but not... But what? Are you drunk? Michael, when I came to London and I told you about Udoka, you fondly called her your wife, and... Oh, God, mercy, Mom. How many times do I have to explain this to you? I've told you times and times again. There's nothing going on between Udoka and I. I mean, there's no way I'm going to marry that girl. Michael, what are you saying? Like I said, Mom, I have nothing with Udoka. Michael! Michael said what? You better call him and hear for yourself. Is he drunk or under some narcotic influence? Michael! Michael! Dad. What did you say about Tudoka? I don't really have anything to say about her. It's just that mom usually refers to her as my wife jokingly. That I did what jokingly? Michael, your mother and I came to London and your mother asked if you would like to marry Udoka. You said yes. And we went ahead to do the introduction. We even called you. True or false? Dad, I, I never knew both of you were serious. I only said yes to mom just to make her happy. Then make me happy by bringing her into my home as your wife. Mom, mom, I, I never intended marrying that girl. Young man, you are joking. Dad, when I was much younger, I used to like Udoka as a friend. Yeah, people around used to call us husband and wife. I, I thought that was all a joke. I mean, that, that doesn't mean I should go ahead and marry the girl. <laughs> I want to believe you are trying to pull our legs. But if this is a joke to you, I am certainly not finding it funny. Dad, look, I, I never made any plans to marry a doka. I mean, I had no intentions of such. Besides, I already have someone I want to marry.
said would 